I didn't make it back when I thought I would to finish this video, but here I am. I hope you enjoyed what you seen. <music>
It says at least 33% fewer calories per serving than most regular ready-to-serve soups. It's light progress, though, 170 calories a can. That's great. You can take this right here and put it over noodles. Well, it has noodles in it, so I probably wouldn't put it over noodles. Maybe over rice or something else, or just eat it as a soup. But it looked good, and I think my husband would eat that. Another one I was thinking of my husband. Yeah, it looks like I might should have got more. These are called Light Progresso Beef Pot Roast. 150 calories, 18.5 ounces. Now, these you can make them stretch. Let me see. It says two servings per container. All of them are two servings per container. So, you can have it with cornbread. You can have it with crackers. You can put it over potatoes. You can put it over rice. You can put it over noodles. This one, you can make it stretch even further. And like I said, it's pantry stock up. I really stocked up on these. I told Michelle, Michelle went with me that day. I said, Michelle, I have a hard time finding tomato soup with basil. These are all reduced sodium. I know, I like progressive. I love tomato with basil. These are the creamy tomato with basil. 110 calories per serving. I bought five of them. I did five of these because I really, really like tomato and basil soup. I eat it with grilled cheese. I eat it with uh, peanut butter and jelly. I'll eat it by itself. I'll eat it with some uh, croutons crumbled in to on top or crackers. Just makes a really good soup or you can even put vegetables and stuff in this soup. And even little meat, say you have like a fourth of a cup or eighth of a cup of beef left or chicken. You can throw it in here and you can add that and you have tomato, basil, chicken soup, beef soup or whatever. So, five cans of that. Minute. Uh, lightly seasoned, ready to serve in 90 seconds. Garlic and olive oil, jasmine, rice. They have... I got one of those, and I think I paid a little over a dollar. I think it's like a dollar twenty-seven, not much more than when I get the Southwestern Pintos and Rice at the Dollar Tree. I've not seen these at the Dollar Tree, but I've seen it at Kroger. So I thought, well, I'm gonna get one and try, and that way too, if the Dollar Tree gets any more, I may be apt to get more. And plus, I could actually use this and this together and uh, stretch a meal, or I can use it with the tomato basil, stretch a meal. I like to uh, try different things, so I thought, well, I'll try that one. And I, even though I have my receipt here, like I said, the light's not quite as good in here, so, yeah. And I noticed I've got something that's still in the car that I was going to show you, but I'll come back and show that to you. How's that? I just now noticed that. Okay. Trail mix. This is pecan pie trail mix. Speaking of fall, I thought it sounded good. I figured eat it like it is. It's the Kroger brand. It's good till May 19th of 22, 10 ounces. It has... Praline, pecans, pecan halves, graham crackers, squares, chocolate chunks, honey, roasted almonds, and whole dried cranberries. It just seemed to hit the spot. So I bought one of those. And I cannot remember if these were on sale or not. I'm looking. Try to look real fast. It, they were $3.99. $3.99. Also got a bag of the pecan pieces, Simply Truth, Simple Truth, 12 ounces, good till April 9th to 22. Again, baking time, cookie time, cake time, pie time. So I bought a bag of these. Remember, these are Kroger's. These were actually $7.99. And I don't know if I could have got them cheaper somewhere else. Didn't even try. I was there that day. So I got it. 
and cranberry cashew trail mix. Sweet and tangy. Mix of cranberries, cashews, almonds, and golden raisins. How could you go wrong? This is a 30 ounce bag for $6.99. $6.99. So you cannot beat that. Love cranberries, love nuts. So be good in bacon just to snack on. So I got one of those. I got two of the chicken flavored stuffing mix. I believe it's 99 cents. Just to have on hand. Like I said, the holidays are coming. We can uh, use these in casseroles. Use them stuffing, pour gravy over them, add chicken to it. Do anything you want to with them, but for 99 cents, it's good. Also, I like to even put some of these like in tomato soup and stuff, so you can't go wrong for 99 cents. Remember, I said pantry stock up, and these are good till looks like May 2022, so I've got time for those. These look really good. I bought two boxes. I'm just going to show you one called Grainberry. Cinnamon frosted with onyx sorghum. Whole grain shredded wheat with uh... I honestly thought the strawberries were in it. It's one reason I got it. Don't think it has the strawberries in it, but I'm sure it's still going to be good. I love shredded wheat. We grew up eating it. I bought two of them. More, now more powerful antioxidants. I thought it had the strawberries. Now I told Michelle, I said, they got the strawberries. I have to buy my strawberries. Uh, I can't remember exactly what I paid for that. Let me see here. I know I got it on sale. And I'm not going to bore you with all the detail. Especially if I can't find it. And I'm pretty sure, let me see, you'd think it would be easy to find it. It was under $2. We'll say that. It was under $2. I think it was like $1.79. But and it, did I tell you it was uh, 16 ounces and no added salt. More free radical protection, more natural plant fiber, more sugar control. So I bought two of those. And I need to put this in the freezer for a couple of days. I bought some all-purpose flour in the King Arthur. Unbleached all-purpose flour, five pounds. Yeah, five pounds. And I actually got it on sale. King Arthur. It was regular $2.99 and I got $1.80 off. So I paid what? Dollar nineteen, I think. If I'm reading right, that's what I paid for it, for five pounds of flour. I have found out that there's certain things you don't want to order online to be sent to you because the prices are triple sometimes, sometimes quadruple. I don't care where you're ordering it from. It seems like if they think you've got the convenience of ordering online, you're going to pay more money for it. And so, there's some things I refuse to buy online. Like I said, I know there's one item in the car that I got. We also had gotten some uh, bread for $1.99, Sara Lee bread, but they done ate it. They did. They have done ate the bread. And, um, yeah. One other item. Let me see here. Really, it's two other items. But it, it was buy one, get one 50% off. But my total was $197.70. And I saved $84.25 by, uh, by clipping the coupons in the app and by looking for the sales items. So my bill would have been a lot higher 
had I not clipped the coupons from Kroger's. This was just a good week when I went to go to Kroger's to buy pantry stock up, to buy freezer stock up, and refrigerator stock up. So, uh, hopefully, when we get back from what we're doing, I'll come back and just show you a small clip of what I did get on, uh, that's not on here, because I remember, I remember seeing it in my trunk. But, stay tuned, right now, I'll show you the stuff I got in the, for the freezer and the refrigerator. I did a clip when I first brought it in my house. I got three of the Kroger Unrolling Baked Pie Crust to put in the freezer. Two nine-inch pie crusts, 15 ounces. Bought three of them. I think I gave $1.67 a piece for those. Almost everything I bought was on sale, or you had to clip your coupons on your app. And I may get back with you on that one later. But I bought two of the cottage cheese small curd. 4% milk fat. Let me see. Yeah. I'm trying to see how many ounces. Uh, 24 ounces. I bought two of those. I think I paid three nineteen for butter. I just bought one when I was working on my freezer last night. I noticed that. Like I knew, I was getting really low on butter, so I thought I'd better get one. I got the Kroger brand, and I always buy the salt it when I can. These I'm questioning about. I'm going to have to ask Michelle, because one of these rang up $1.29. Maybe that was the dollar off. That might have been why. Because you bought three and got a dollar off. I don't know what regular price was. That might be why. One of them rang up $1.29. These were two twenty nine. Something quick in the mornings with gravy and eggs, and you've got a meal. Didn't want to go into Walmart today, and I'm missing my Greek yogurt, and I'm hoping I can, I like this one. It is uh, Kroger's Greek yogurt, vanilla flavored with other natural flavors. And it was, I think, like $3.99. Comparable to Walmart's yogurt. I'm not sure about the sides of it. This one's 32 ounces. I think that's what Walmart is. Now I bought one. And when I go to Walmart, I am going to stock up on yogurt for sure. Eli loves country crock. I got him the one with the calcium. Don't remember how much I paid for it. But I got one of those. Got a gigantic tub, 48 ounces of Kroger sour cream. Again, can't remember if it was on sale. I bought, The reason I went, they had 80%, 20% lean and fat hamburger, ground beef. And they had them in three-pound chubs. Yeah, three pounds. They were $2.49 a pound. Two forty nine a pound. So each chub I think was like seven fifty seven, and I bought five chubs, cause that's a good price for lean ground beef around here. Got some just cheaper hot dogs, bar s jumbo freaks. Uh, they were a dollar twenty five a piece. We do like these. A lot of people don't. I think Omi eats them too. I know a friend of mine eats them. So I went ahead and bought two packs for dollar twenty five a piece. This one I'm probably going to shoot myself for, kick myself. I bought uh, chicken leg quarters from Kroger's. They're regular $2.99 a pound seasoned. See how they're seasoned? And with the card, I saved $7.06. I gave $3.49. I might see another Kroger visit in my future because I really would like to stock up. Uh, some of this meat. I just need to finish going through my freezer and see how much room I have. A dozen eggs because my hens aren't laying well, and I think they were a dollar twenty something. Uh, got one orange juice a gallon. Kroger brand. I got a dollar off with the coupon. I got one whole milk vitamin D. Can't remember how much I paid, but I got that. 
believe, and the cheese. It was supposed to be on sale and a dollar off with the uh, coupon on the app. I got sharp cheddar uh, shredded cheese, 32 ounces. Natural cheese. So I bought one of them good to February 23rd. I know I'll use that before then. Got one of the artesian bakery breads. Good till October 4th. Sarah Lee got it on sale for $1.99 with the coupon that you clip online. And of course, I had to get, since I wasn't going to Walmart, I had to get some bananas. So, I'm going to put all this cold stuff up. Let me see. Yeah, I'll put all the cold stuff up, and when I get the rest of it together, I'll bring you back. Life takes over. It does. Different day, different clothes. I was going to finish up this Kroger haul because I think I told you I spent like $197, and I saved almost $90. Uh, but I had at least one product I knew I wanted to show you, and my boys have gotten into a couple of others. I bought the limited edition Hostess Donuts. And you can tell they've already gotten into them. Uh, they were $1.99. The only reason I know that is because I was trying to make sure of, uh, it, that this was in the Kroger haul. And it was. Because I have a basket sitting here. I've got another haul coming up. But I'm going to have to leave out before I can do any more video because I've had a sick little boy. Yeah. That's one reason I've not been uh, on top. I should have done this a couple of nights ago. But he's been sick. I hope he's getting better. And if not, we'll take him to the doctor. But right now, we're able to take care. But he had a special request. And I don't have it here. It's nothing he has to have. But I want to get it for him. I got some Kroger white corn tortillas. Uh, one pound, eight ounces. I should have looked to see how much they were. But I've got a dish coming up with these. I bought four of these. They were two seventy-five, two twenty-five off, I think is what it said. And you can see the boys have gotten into it. So I have four of them. I've just got this one sitting here. It was the closest. But it's the Pepsi Zero Sugar. Not buying quite as much in the sodas anymore, but my husband still requests them, and when he requests them, I get them. I've been wanting to get some bakeware uh, that had handles. My sick little boy. How sick have you been, Eli? Bad sick. Bad sick. Oh, where's my Pringles? I'll get them in a minute, honey. I'm back. He wanted Pringles this time. The one thing I was wanting to show you is the Easy Grab Pyrex. This is the one and a half quart. I call them loaf pans. They're Easy Grab. They had them buy one, get one free. So I went ahead and bought two of them because I make meat loaves a lot and I want to start making bread. I needed something that I could grip. And I was actually looking for something kind of colorful to grip, and I probably could have got some Pioneer Woman or something. But since this one was on sale and had the lids, I think one was, uh, I don't remember how much. Hang on. One was, uh, got it in here, I know. Cause I seen it. I should have kept you off while I'm looking. One was $13.99 and one was $6.99. I thought that was a fairly good deal to have these handles because I have arthritis real bad. I'm known to let my bakeware slip out of my hand when I'm uh, trying to get it out of the oven. And this purchase also led to another purchase you'll be seeing but not from Kroger's. I hope you enjoyed this pantry stock up, freezer stock up, stuff for the refrigerator haul. It just took me a minute to get it all done. I'm, I've got more coming to you. 
as you see. And I got some stuff from Amazon coming. Um, let me see what else. Coming from Amazon. Thrive Life. Is it Thrive Life? Thrive Market, I think. Thrive Market, Amazon, and Sam's. Those are some hauls you can expect to see in the near future. So, uh, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate each and every one of you. And until next time, we'll talk soon.